Hi everyone, it's a new day in Wrong World and I am just so excited. Oh my goodness, we have done so much. Oh, I tell you what, it has been a long road. <laughs> but look here, we do have, what was that? I saw something. Oh, I'm so nervous in this game. We do have our anvil and look at our junk pile. Oh my gosh, that is such a mess. I hope we can soon... I hope we can get our little house and maybe some chests um, and we can maybe sort stuff a little bit so that it's not quite so messy. My goodness. But we do have our anvil. I wanted to show you that because we have the anvil, gosh, I'm tripping over everything. My goodness. Because we have the anvil, we have some new recipes. Um, if you look, these are what we can do in the smelter. I think I showed those before. But um, we do have the ability to... Oh, here we go. It's We do have the ability to make more items. And I think today our main focus needs to be on better protection and a better weapon. So we might start out with the wooden staff, but I would like to do the Sith or Scythe sickle <laughs> a scythe i'm going to call it a scythe um it needs 10 iron 10 wood one iron bar and one anvil i'm curious though i almost feel like i've learned um in experimenting just a little bit that i seem to be able to battle better without any kind of tool or weapon it says the wooden staff does 10 damage uh the scythe does 15 damage the halberd? I'm curious about the scythe. It says it destroys grassy tufts, like the Grim Reaper. So I wonder, will it give us things if we... I, that's, that's why I kind of want to do the scythe. But also, I'm looking at these power fists. We can't get there yet. We need copper wiring for the power fist, but that gives you 20 power. I want to do this little wooden mask first off, because it does give us a little bit of armor. Oh, it's already getting night. My goodness, I shouldn't... I should have talked faster. Um, the wooden mask gives us a tiny bit of armor. I wonder if we can, let's see what, it needs two leather. Oh, we need another leather. Okay, and it needs the workbench. So we need to get some more leather. I think, um, and when we were fishing, we were getting some boots from fishing and turning those into leather. So maybe, oh, what, uh-oh. Uh, did you hear, did you see that? The whole world kind of rumble just a bit. I almost feel like we need to stay right here for protection against those green, bleh, those yucky things. Um, man, I don't, you know, I haven't seen them in the sand, though. I wonder if they don't appear in the sand. So let's go down here and try to do some fishing. Maybe get some boots. One thing that I'm excited about, I was able with, if you have a stack of, oh, look at our hunger. Let's go back really fast. We don't want our hunger to go down uh, I, I, we do have some garden, um, ooh, let's get this acorn, good, um, and also, ooh, I wanted to show you guys, um, just too much to talk about, I'm so excited, um, see how all the trees grew, I'm really excited about this, as long as those green slug things don't actually spawn right here in our little area, the trees are keeping them out. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Um, I'm not sure about this little place. See, we can go in and out. But those... Oh, oh shoot. <laughs> okay, let's see if it works. Let's see if... Oh, there's one on both sides. Oh my word. What the... Oh my gosh. Look at them. See? But see how it works? Oh, the one outside can get me. Okay, look, this is a good time to show you guys... I figured out you can actually hurt these guys better if you don't have a um, tool in your hand. Let's see, where'd he go? Okay, let's get him. Look at this. Watch, watch, watch. Now I can do my shift and target him. See, look at my cool moves. Awesome. Oh, he is hurting me, though. Uh, let's get him, get him, get him. And see, actually, I took the shift off and it worked better. I don't know. I just don't understand about the shift thing. It just doesn't seem to... But look at this. All these guys are stuck in here, and they can't get out. And they can't shoot me. 
which right now that means I can't go in there and eat my food, but see, watch. See, he can try to shoot me. Look at that. Isn't that, that is awesome. Usually they don't spawn inside there, but you know what? I almost wonder, did you, you know, we had that rumbling. Oh, yay. Awesome. And if after that earthquake thing, I wonder if that causes more of those slug looking things to appear. Wow, that night seemed like it went by fast. Thank goodness. Okay, now we can eat our food before we go fishing. Whew. Okay, you hold down your right click key and that will harvest. We can eat all of this before we go fishing and get our hunger back up. Get our, hopefully our um, health will regenerate. I hope. Where did that potato go? Okay, now press E and eat carrot. Broccoli. One more, maybe. All right. Perfect. Now, let's go drop some of the stuff in our junk pile, because we're going to be fishing, and we want to be able to have enough room. I'm really hoping that those slug guys don't, aren't able to get us in the sand. That would be really good. Let's go ahead and put our mushroom over here by the campfire, because we want to eat it. But that was weird how there was an earthquake, and all of those all spawned right where I was. Ooh, wonder where I got all these coins. Oh, you know what? I think it was from fishing. When I was fishing yesterday. See my bait? You can make bait with one meat makes ten bait. Keep some of these in your inventory to speed up fishing and maybe attract a better class of fish. So I wanted to try that with you guys and see. So we have some meat. Let's go and put our acorns down because we don't and we don't need to be carrying our leather around with us. We can come back and get that. Gosh, the junk pile's getting bigger and bigger. Um, do we have any seeds? No. If we had seeds, we could go ahead and plant them, and they could be growing while we're fishing. But anyway, all right. So I think we might be caught up with everything I uh, everything I learned. I learned about the fishing about the bait. I learned that those trees could be like a nat natural fence row. Um, and I learned that I can stay inside that fence normally. I don't know. Those Usually the slugs did not get inside with me. Okay, so our fishing pole is our number four. And then what we have to do is we have to find some fish. Let's see here. Oh, yep, there's one. I really like the fishing mechanics. Um, you just left click your key, it throws, oh, that was instant, awesome. And then you have to watch for the little red circle to turn green, right here. So you have to be patient, and then we did it. Okay, one globfish, that's good. We only need two more of those guys, and we can make some fish sticks. Uh, more fish out here? Did we get all, oh, it's night already? Gosh. I don't know what the deal is, guys, but it just feels like it's going super fast. Maybe it's just because I'm having more fun now. Um, hey, that looks like a fish way out there. Is that a fish? Yeah, right there. Let's throw it way out there. Ooh, that may not be far enough. We'll give it a few minutes. I'm not sure what the bait does. It says it gives you better class, but I wonder if it also brings the fish faster. That's possible. Let's watch. Be very watchful. Okay. Yeah. Maybe. Nope. Oh, he went out of range. Come on, little fishy. I wonder. Come on. The music is so soothing. Um. Hmm. Well, that's disappointing. I was hoping the bait would... This isn't real. Let's see. Let's see if we can find a fish that's closer to us. Oh, here we go. I was hoping the bait would be super amazing, awesome. Let's see here. Um, nope. Bad aim. Oh, maybe. Oh, no! Okay. Those little frog guys. I had one of them pop out at me. What we're going to do is get rid of our... Wait. What's that? Oh, there's a slug guy. So they do come out in the sand. <laughs> 
Where's the frog guy? Oh, we got two now. Okay. And our health is not high enough. I mean, our hunger is not high enough to regen our health. So let's try to outrun them maybe. Oh, push. All right. I would have liked to have tried to get the frog, but I didn't realize the slug guys got in the sand too. I had not. I don't think I'd seen them in the sand before. Let's see. Can I outrun them at all? There's a little campfire. I know I didn't. Oh, yeah. I think we did it, guys. All right, let's look for fish over here. Let's see. Maybe they won't bother us. Yeah, okay. Any fish? It'll be daylight soon, and that'll get get rid of the slug guy, and then we, maybe we can go get the frog guy. I think the frog may be how I got all those coins, maybe. I can't remember. I thought the frog people chased me forever before... No, I've been over here, apparently. Let's grab that wood. Oh, there's a snake guy. We could try to get him, I think. I'll show you my ninja moves. Let's see if we can target on him. Yep, 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 yep. Don't let him hit us. Don't let him hit us. There we go. Awesome. See, it's it's like you can, you can fight so much better without a tool in your hand. <laughs> now, that seems kind of silly, doesn't it? I mean... I would think a pick would do much better work. Oh, good, there's a mushroom. Well, we may not even get to fish. We may just find lots of food without fishing. All right, so let's try to fish now that it's daylight. I, I think these flowers are going to come in handy later down the road, but I don't want to fill up my inventory. Do you see any fish? I really was hoping by making the bait, because that meat was precious. I was like, oh, should I use the meat for food? Or should I make some bait and catch some food? Hmm. Oh, here's a fish. Good, good, good. Let's see if this if this makes it worth it. Your line goes way far out, so maybe target there. Oh, let's put our fish fishing pole in our hand and stand back here. And target that fish. Oh, see, it still went. No, that's about right. All right, okay, here we go. We could get a little bit closer, maybe. Okay, watch for it to turn green. This is a better class. I don't know what that means. If we get iron fish or food fish. Oh, yep, we got a copper fish. Oh, and that fish disappeared. All right, so let's see if we can find some more. I'll tell you what, guys, I am not going to... Oh! What happened? Hmm, that was interesting. Save game, maybe jump in the water somehow. Um, I'm going to use up all this bait. I won't make you sit and watch me, but after I'm done, I will show you all the stuff I got. How about that? So I'll be back in just a little bit. All right, guys, I'm back, but <laughs> I didn't use up all my bait. I have three more worms left, but I'm having a really difficult time I was trying to cross the little river um, first. I tried to cross this little river, and I had this octopus thing came out and chewed me up, but good. I died, and I had to run back. Then By then, my food was way down, so I ate some. I had to find all of my stuff. Well, the octopus guy killed me in the river, so I wasn't sure where all my stuff was, but I kept wandering around in the river. I finally was able to pick up everything. I couldn't see it, but I was just holding down my right click. And I figured out why I wasn't able to escape the octopus guy. There's a little tiny rim up on the beach, and I wasn't able to jump up above that as a little tiny gray line. If I moved down to where the sand touched the water, I could get up, but in that one area, I could not get up, so that thing was able to kill me and get, take all my stuff, but I was able to get all of my things. That's the good thing about easy mode. I started fishing again. This is what I have so far. I did get three puffer fish. Um, the little frog guys kept popping out of the water, so I got two coins and a bunch of leather from them. I was able to get that one copper fish and a puffer fish, so... I'm not sure what the better quality of bait means because I wasn't having much, to me it wasn't any different fishing uh, that without bait. So I think I'll save my precious meat and fish without bait if I'm going to fish. 
but I do have the leather and that's what we wanted. I do have three blobfish, so that'll make some fish sticks. And you can see my health was completely full and just the last time I threw in my line, five of these frogs popped out. So I ran all the way back up here. So you can see just from running back from the water all the way back here, look how low my health is now. So I don't know. It seems like to me it goes down super fast. Um, I don't know. I, to me, I don't. I don't know. I don't know how the game mechanics are supposed to work. But when you have to constantly be worrying about your food, see, my health is fine as long as I don't fight anything. But my food is still going way down, super fast, just from running up the beach. That's how far that went up. So. Um, let's go ahead and stop worrying about it, and let's cook some of this wonderful fish fingers. We have some meat. I wonder what you do with the puffer fish. I'm almost feeling, it says, become a mastery of the way of exploding fish. So that makes me think, possibly a weapon of some kind? I'm not sure. We can, on the way back from my death, I picked up mushrooms. <laughs> When I got back and was able to get my stuff, I was able to eat all my carrots and broccoli that we had planted, but I've already finished eating those up. Um, so now, let's see, we still have some meat. Let's go ahead and make us some cooked meat. And that'll give us a little bit of food for now, but look, it's already down to 65%, which is fine. Let's go ahead and eat our meat. The meat gives 25, so that'll get us up that far. That's fine as long as we don't get into any fights. We're doing fine. Okay, so what I okay, what we wanted to do was get us a mask. So let's grab this leather. Does, and that I believe. Let's see, what was our mask? Um wooden mask is ten wood. We have gosh, we have lots of wood. Two leather and a workbench. Oh, we get to make our mask. Awesome. And I believe this thing is supposed to help us that when we... Now, let's see. Basic defense. It makes you look a little bit like an acorn beast. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so right click maybe? Yes. Oh, <laughs> let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I want to see. No way. <laughs> oh, now that is awesome. Look at that. Now, that's going to protect us, I think, a little bit. A little bit, for sure. It's bound to. And maybe we won't take as much damage, possibly. That would be awesome. And it is a beautiful day. So now we have our protection because one of the things that we want to do right now, I think we want to start thinking about a house. I feel like if we have a house, we won't have to... Um, worry about protection so much we can just run into our house really quickly I'm a little bit concerned about all this junk we need a box to put all this in so it's not all over the ground um, but maybe it won't be in our way I do I do think this is going to be in our way so I guess let's see how full is our inventory very full let's go put everything over here maybe we'll get it over here out of the way don't want to put it too much over there because it'll run down the hill um, let's go ahead and put all of this stuff down except our food. Just constantly. Okay, well, first, before I put everything down, oh, no, I, I do need to just move. You know what? I'll tell you what, guys. I'm going to go ahead and cut right here. I'm going to move all this stuff over so you don't have to watch me do that. Then we'll come back and try to begin working on our house. I'll BRB. All right, everyone. I moved everything around. I looked in my crafting area, and I want... I want to build these modular house tiles. To do that, I need 10 wood and 10 stone. So I have plenty of wood, but I don't have a lot of stone. So that's definitely got to be our next thing. I've been wandering around, and it looks like over there in that darkish area, there's quite a bit of stone. So we're going to go over there and see if we can't get some stone. Now, I want to try out our little mask. Here's our little campfire. I wish we could destroy them. I'm not sure how to do that. Um, but uh, I wish I could destroy it and get... Can you, like... No? If I click on it... No? It's a, right click will light it. So I'm not sure. But anyway, 
Let's try out our little mask on this guy right here. Ooh, I wonder what. We just got an achievement. Deep, deep undercover, is it? Because we're... Look, he doesn't even see us. <laughs> oh my gosh, he doesn't even see us. I wonder now if I attack him, though. Oh, if I attack him, will he attack me back? Well, we don't want to try. Yes, he will attack me. I guess maybe once you just push our shift. There we go. I guess once you attack him, he sees you. But otherwise, you can just kind of... He won't even bother us until we bother him. Ooh, that gave us a flapple. See, my, our, I just filled up my health, and now the health is already down again. It just goes down too fast. Okay, so that was good. We were able to get him without any health damage. Let's go grab this mushroom, because those are really... Hey, does the snake see us? <laughs> oh, yeah, he sees us. <laughs> oh, shoot. Darn. Okay. Let's get him. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Let's get him. Get him. Get him. Maybe we should have made that wooden staff. I wonder if that would help. I don't know. I, I feel like we have better aim, maybe, um, without a tool or a weapon. Okay, so let's see. Our health is down to 78%, 77%. So we're okay if we wait. We can wait just a little bit. The fish fingers gives us 40, so we don't want to waste it. Um, oh, you know what? Our little campfire that we were talking about destroying? Maybe it's good not to destroy the campfires because I can come over here and, now where was it? And cook this meat. Oh, here it is right here. Let's do that really quick. That snake gave us a little bit of meat. Nope. Luke Q. Knife and fork. Awesome. We'll do that. And that. Just try that. Alright. Eat our meat. There we go. Alright. So that works. If it just wouldn't go down so fast. Because I really would like to get some of this stone before we die. <laughs> I want to show you guys the house. I went into creative mode for a few minutes just to uh, see if I could figure out how to uh, build a house. It's not too bad. It's really kind of fun once you figure out how to do it. There's frogs, which frogs are good because they do give you coins and they give you boots uh, for leather. So that's good. Maybe we wonder if we should go kill him before he sees us. Let's see if we can get this one. And that truck is, oh, well that guy won't bother us because we have our mask on. So that's a good thing, huh? Oh, that's fun. We are so good at being a spy. Undercover. Alright, let's go ahead and kill him. Uh, maybe we can kill him and then run. I wonder if we can run backwards. Can you run? Yo, yeah, oh, you can. Awesome. Oh, oh, oh. That's awesome. Okay, let's get him. So once you hit him once, they do see you, even if you have your mask on. Let's get him before he can hit us. Awesome. Bad thing about fighting, I want to fight because we get all good stuff, but fighting, I think your hunger goes down even faster. Let's see how we're doing. Um, no, 90% we're okay for now. Let's grab these rocks. Okay, here we go. Oh, and there's some mushrooms. Alright. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. We want to have first dub. Nope, do not get us. Okay, let's target him. Do away with our tool. Because our ninja moves are awesome. Awesome. <laughs> okay. That's much better. Oh my goodness. I'll have to try that. Um, maybe that staff. And see. Oh great. I don't like these guys at all. Um, let me see. Let me go ahead and try to craft them. Watch my back. And see if I can craft that hal uh, right here. This halber, uh, no, the uh, wooden staff. Let's see. We have lots of wood. We have all those beautiful trees at our camp. 
All right, now let's put the halberd, I mean the staff, in our number, I think I put it in number three, and have the shovel over here in my number four for now. So number three. All right, guys. Hopefully we won't die. Okay, here we go. There we go. We targeted, and we're killing him. Hopefully. Come on, come on, come on. Get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him. No. was that? Did you guys see that? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. A tornado? Oh guys. No. Is it coming? Oh my gosh. No. Oh. Oh my gosh. Now this is why. We oh, what happened to my character? What's wrong with my character? Is the tornado getting me? Oh. Is that the tornado doing? Oh my gosh. What the? How long do they last? Darn. Am I going back toward my camp? You know what? I don't think I want to take it back to my camp. Tornadoes are known to destroy a house. I wonder. Is it going to follow me forever? Oh my gosh. What happens if the tornado gets you? It's, ooh, I wonder if it'd be like Dorothy and take us to Oz. <laughs> oh, oh, man. I think that's the tornado getting me. So, I don't know. Should I just keep running or should I let the tornado get me? If it gets me, will I drop all my items here? Oh, man. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. <gasps> it's daylight. Maybe it'll stop now. Will it stop? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. I don't think it's going to stop, guys. What should we do? I don't want to go to my house. It might tear up my base. Mm -hmm. Is it just... Oh, look at that. Did you... Oh, I think that's the tornado doing that. Oh. So, should I just let it pick me up? going down. It might be best to let it pick me up. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Here's this little peninsula thing. We'll know right where we are so we can get our items if we die. Alright, so here's our safe place right here. Alright, tornado, come at me. Do your best. Give it your best shot. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, what's it doing? <gasps> Maybe now it's going to go away. Maybe I should run into it. Oh my gosh. Of course, when we finally decide to let <laughs> let it come to us it does go away so maybe that's the secret you have to stand still oh man whoo we oh my god guys <laughs> oh let's see if we can get some more stone and go build us a house i'm so curious about so many things oh. all right calm down how much rock have we got so far? 25. We need like, I want to do, oops. I want to do, I think, six foundations. And if we each one takes 10 stone, we need at least 60 stone, I think. So let's see if we can get 60. And there's one of those guys. I'm not sure how good at battling they are. If we go try. Oh, our hunger is getting way down. Let's see. Um, okay, at this point, we can eat our mushroom soup. That's good. Yeah, awesome. Okay. Oh, look at all the enemy. Oh. Now, there's one of those little guys. You know what? I was reading on the forums, and these aren't kitty cats. They're pigs, and they're supposed to be an amazing source of food. But, gosh... I hate killing anything that isn't mean to me. 
So we, we won't worry about it right now. We won't kill him yet. Unless we just absolutely have to. Because they're just too cute. Okay, we're doing good now. Okay, now it's slugfest time. <laughs> oh my gosh, have you ever been anywhere where they have lots of slugs? You can smell them. Up in the up up in the Pacific Northwest, around all the campgrounds that we've camped in, you can you can always smell when there's slugs around. They just have this distinct sludgy, yucky odor. Wow, we're getting a lot of it, ore, so that's good. All right, so here we go. We're doing good. All right, guys, I think I will let you go for just a little bit. I'm going to go ahead until I can get... <gasps> How much do we have? 52. We almost have enough. I'm going to chop all the rocks that I can find in this area, and I will bring you back. Undercover, though. Undercover. All right, guys, I wanted to bring you back. I found this barrel, and I didn't want to open it. Whoops. I didn't want to open it unless you were with me. So, I thought I'd bring you back just so I could get this barrel. Ooh, oh my goodness, look at all the treasures. Oh, inventory full. Let's see, let's drop this ice. We don't need that right now, but we, that broccoli and carrots, that looks awesome. Ooh, and there's a gold coin. I like that. Uh, inventory full. Let's go ahead, we, we're down on our health again. Did we not pick up the, oh here, broccoli. Let's eat the broccoli. That'll pull it up a little bit, and then we can eat, get this carrot and this potato. And we need, oh, inventory full, so let's go ahead and eat the carrot. Pick up the coin. We want that for sure. And inventory full again. Let's drop, um, what can we drop? The sand. We don't need the sand. We can come back. The great thing about this game is that everything is laying on the ground, and it never disappears. So... That'd be a fun exploration just to find all the stuff we dropped over time. All right, guys. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the video. I do have enough stone, but I want to be able to take a lot of time to explain how to build these houses. And it's getting dark, so I have to hurry. I appreciate each and every one of you so very, very much. Bye for now. Bye, everyone.